hey guys thanks for stopping through welcome back to the channel if you haven't done so already join the family and subscribe today i felt like playing in some hair my nerves were on edge so i grabbed my tony daily gabrielle unit and i started playing around with it what you see here is me cutting about an inch into the front so that i could wear like a side part parting my own hair I typically don't like leave out but that was just the only a little piece and I wanted to figure out how to create some sort of illusion just to have fun and plus like I said my nerves were uh rat a tat tat and I just I love hair anyway I love playing with hair cutting it so this is what I'm doing um as you can see it doesn't blend well my grays don't blend well with the unit and to rectify that issue what i do is simply get some black mascara brush it over the front put on some um gel to lay the edges and i keep it moving and right here i am cutting in a little bit of volume playing around with it uh no rhyme or reason <laughs> this was like this unit is a good go-to cover girl. I'm telling you, there's not much that you really need to do to it, but I've had it for so many years and I just wanted to play around with some hair, like I said. Here I'm using my old school Denman brush. This was the ultimate brush that I would use on my hair when I went back to natural in 2003. No other tool touched my hair. And look how beautiful it, it's making my unit even more fluffy and just gorgeous. Okay, so I am done cutting into my Gabrielle wig. I've had this wig, I would say for two to three years it has been my go-to ride or die unit when i first bought it <clears throat> you know I, t I tend to cut into my wigs a lot because i have this thing to me it's like art and crafts and i have this thing where when i was little i always wanted one of those barbie heads to do the hair never got one and so now I do it all the time and I'm cutting and styling wigs and sometimes it's a nervous condition and anyway I woke up this morning at like 6 a.m. and was like you know I couldn't doze back off and I was like okay um, I want to play in some hair so over the years every time I put my unit on I'll like you know snip here and there just to you know make it frame my face or whatever this was the one unit that I got that I felt like I really didn't have to do anything to. But as time goes on, you know, you play around with it and you cut and you snip or whatever. And it's really, it's still a really good wig, y'all. I mean, this cover girl is still giving us life. And I wanted to create some more volume and make it kind of top heavy. I really like that top heavy look and since I'm always trying to decide what I want to do with my own hair I figured well why not try it out on a few of my wigs now granted I'm not gonna cut my own hair you know this short but I did want I do want volume so I thought I would do this and this is it guys just something to do until the next video live simply and be kind